We're at the offices of Good House and Company and we're having a really exciting tasting organised by Sarah Marsh of the 2002 vintage in the Cote d'Or. Well, 2002 vintage, it was quite a warm August to begin with, quite dry, and then it was a little bit wet, quite damp, a bit overcast, uh, and then right at the end, before the harvest, uh, um, in the second half of September, along came a nice cold north wind, and that cleaned everything up, and it kept the freshness and the acidity. You could really see why you had Premier Cru and Grand Cru vineyards. The best located vineyards achieved a greater level of ripeness and then they got this sort of sweetness of fruit and this slightly additional concentration. For me it's always been a more sort of elegant, refined style of red burgundy. The style of winemaking at the time really comes through. And what does it tell us about this vintage is it's the one you want to buy, it's the one you want to drink and it's the one you want to keep. So it's like it's the magical triangle, you want to do everything with this once. The wines are marvellous to taste when they're young, but if you taste these wines, the Cremier Cru and Grand Cru, when they're young, you sort of miss the point. Because as wines age, what they lose in youthfulness, they gain in maturity, like all of us. With age, you get these extraordinary nuances. You get a, a better balance between the richness of the fruit, the softness of the tannins, this bright freshness as well. If you sell uh, the wines away for a longer time, then you get something more complex and profound that winemaking can't make. You, only time can give you that complexity. There's some of them, they still taste so fresh, so elegant, so pure, and that's a real joy in the wines, you know, that's that sweet spot between getting the best out of the vineyard and the best out of a particular producer. Give the wines time to mature, you can peel back the layers, you can understand the terroir and you can really appreciate the tapestry that is Burgundy.